What do you think of the report being released today, its contents, and what the recommendation was from the special grand jury? You know, I have, uh, I'm very worried about the country right now. I was the chairman of the Senate Judiciary Committee. This election was contested in courts and multiple states. I had to explain to the people of South Carolina my vote, had to decide whether or not to have a hearing about the allegations in Georgia and other places. Uh, I called around different states, including Georgia, as a sitting United States Senator, Chairman of the Judiciary Committee. I eventually certified the election in all states, including Georgia. I didn't find any evidence of mass voter fraud, but I did have concerns about the mail-in ballot systems in Georgia and other places. This is troubling for the country. We can't criminalize senators doing their job when they have a constitutional requirement to fulfill. It would be irresponsible for me, in my opinion, as chairman of the committee, not to try to find out what happened. It would be irresponsible for me to tell the voters of South Carolina what I did without actually trying to find out what the right answer was. So we're opening up Pandora's box here. Fulton County is one of the most liberal jurisdictions in the country. I fear this will spread, that the next election, Democrats may be on the other side of this. So at the end of the day, nothing happened. What I did was consistent with my job as being United States Senator, Chairman of the Judiciary Committee, but it was just not me. Three United States Senators were opening up Pandora's box. I think the system in this country is getting off the rails. And we have to be careful not to use the legal system as a political tool.